What is going on, my Cardano friends? It's your friend Jack here. And yes, if you are the title, today I made a betrayal to my Cardano friends and I bought some Ergo. But let's go into this video, why I bought Ergo and why I think this is actually a very good play for what's to come this year. So many of you may already know the reason why I swapped from Cardano to Ergo, at least why I swapped 15% of all my Cardano into Ergo. This is a lot of money and honestly, it is somewhat risky, but from a level that I'm in, in my conviction with Ergo, I don't really see it as any more risky than holding Cardano. Here's the thing though, Ergo is much less uh, valuable or worth a lot less right now in terms of market cap. That is the major component that is going to accelerate gains for someone with less capital. Obviously, it's going to be harder to go from 65 billion market cap to 120 billion market cap than it would be from a ergo standpoint, 500 million, half a billion. So, you know, 1 120th uh, or 1 1 30th of er Cardano. Ergo has more room to grow in that sense. And same thing with Bitcoin. Obviously, it's harder to double because it's such a high valuation. So Ergo, where is it on this list? Well, it's actually way down the list. And it is way down the list, way down the list, not even in the top 100. Sitting at a 500 million market cap, it's going to take us a while to scroll down there. So I'm just going to type it in. We're going to go take a look. And I've been talking about Ergo for about five months on this channel. Back uh, five months ago, I made a video on Ergo. If you want to check it out, it is Ergo Explained. I'll leave that video down in the description. It's the first time I ever came across Ergo. So I made a video on it. I did not buy any Ergo then. I picked up my bag of Ergo about two or three months later after I made that video, mostly because I didn't have any money to buy Ergo at the time back when I made that video. But today I have some capital and I traded some Cardano over to Ergo because I think this last quarter of the year, we are going to see Cardano pump to five plus dollars but i also think we're going to see ergo pump to 50 plus dollars a 5x 5 to 10x is very possible with ergo because the market cap would still be relatively small at less than five billion dollars not even getting close to the top 10 and still kind of being under the radar so yeah i didn't sell all of my cardano for ergo just 15 percent of it really not that much 15 to 20 percent is not the end of the world and i have high conviction in this investment because i've done my research because i've looked around i'm not telling you to go buy ergo right now i'm telling you look into ergo and see if you like it see if you can find some conviction in there and reasons to justify to yourself and convince yourself why it's a good investment and not just convince yourself but also obviously back that conviction with good solid reasoning and logic if your only logic is I'm investing in Ergo because it's very small, rank 186 out of all tokens, and it can go to the moon, that's not good logic. It is underlying technology and fundamentals that ultimately drive the finalized price points in most cases. So no, this is not a meme token. This is its own blockchain, and it also doubles in the Cardano sphere using a similar model that can be compatible with Cardano transactions and things on that blockchain, which is why it first interested me. And also going along with that, it provides Oracle data to Cardano and they even have their own DEX, not Ergo specifically, but there is a DEX on Cardano building called Ergo DEX, which will have Ergo capabilities, which is pretty darn cool. And another reason why I'm bullish on Ergo, the blockchain by itself as well. Now the DEX is going to have its own token and it's not really related to ERG, but it still is going to bring value to the Ergo ecosystem in that blockchain. This is another reason why I think the price could not only 2x, 3x, 4x, 5x, 6x, but go up to a 10x for this last bull run leg of 2021. I think if Bitcoin goes to 100k or more, which honestly I'm pretty convinced that it will, then ADA is going to pump a lot, yes, but the smaller coins like Ergo will go crazy. And when I say crazy, I mean 5 to 10x or even more in some cases because they can, because their market cap is 299 million, not even half a billion dollars. And there's so much room for growth here. And when you have this really good technology, 
uh, pretty much Bitcoin 2.0 is what I call it. That's where my conviction comes from. That's why I chose to take a large portion of my Cardano and trade it over to USDT and then exchange at USDT for Ergo. That's what I did today. And those are kind of the reasons for it because I can turn, let's say, let's say we have $10,000 worth of Cardano. I can turn that $10,000 if this 10X is into $100,000. Here we are, if this 10X is Cardano probably only two to four X, that's kind of where I'm at right here. The relevance of how much times Cardano price multiplies is kind of exponentially more as you go down the list of smaller market caps, especially when you're relating to the same ecosystem where Ergo is not only its own blockchain, but also linked to Cardano. Ergo has a potential to me to 5, 10x when Cardano does a 2 or 3x. So if I kept my money in Cardano, yes, I would get a 2 to 3x. But if I bring it over to Ergo, I'm going to get, you know, three, four times the amount on return on investment. Obviously, though, this is all speculation and I could get wrecked from this. Maybe Ergo goes to a very little amount and Cardano skyrockets. But the risk that I'm taking here to me is less risk and more of a calculated gamble. Yes, it is somewhat still of a gamble, but it's gamble backed by conviction. So it is to me an investment. I'm trading over my Cardano for a higher return on Ergo, a blockchain that I would totally be comfortably holding their token for for three to five years. So think about those things. I'm not just looking at short-term profit. I'm also taking into account that if the bull lag doesn't happen for Ergo this cycle, I'm fine with holding however much I have in Ergo, knowing that eventually it's probably going to go up because I have a lot of conviction in their technology and what they're doing over at Ergo. Okay, that's the video for today, and we'll stop talking about Ergo, and we'll get back to Cardano tomorrow. Anyways, I hope you guys had a great freaking day, and I'll see you guys in the next video. It's been your friend Jack. Peace out.